everybody. In this video, I'm going to introduce you to slice and splice functions in an array using Webler. So let's get started. So I've already done everything here to save time. So you can see I have declared the variable fruit basket, which has the fruit from A to I. So you can see here. So now I'm going to print this over here and in the end I will print it over here in the old basket and new basket. So we're going to give console.table. So console.table is similar to console.log except that it prints it in a table form. For example, I'm going to give console.table fruit basket you can see here it shows the fruit basket so now I'm just going to go to console inspect console control L and if you give control L it creates refresh and see so you can see here it has printed all of them so there is one that is okay. There's one one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So there are nine elements and in max of index eight index. So now I'm going to start with slice operation. So I'm going to give a variable variable, new basket, so it's given over. And I'm going to give no basket. So I'm going to use like this. N is small, D is capital. Called camel casing because the first letter won't be capital in the first word, but the second word, the first cap, the first letter will be capital. So variable new basket equals to new basket give dot and slice of slice. So I'm gonna start with slice. So slice is like I'm starting an index ending index. For example, in the index, you can take any one. So, I'm going to take the starting position as LWD, which is 4, and you might think when I give, when I like want hop plum to be the end, I'm going to give 7, since the first parameter is the starting, starting and the second parameter is the ending. But actually, I have to give 8 because in that, in the slice, actually it goes to the end but then it doesn't include it. Like, for example, I've given 4 which is elder body to 8 which is eta plum. So, text, text elder body fig, grapes, hop plum, eta plum. But doesn't include the eta plum, it excludes it. So it will come elderberry fake grapes and hop plum. So let me see if it works. So I'm just going to give console.table again. Console.table new basket. So you can see here, this is the normal array, which is apple, banana, cherry, dates, like normal. And in here, you can see elderberry, fake, grapes, and hop plum. So in the slice uh, operation, instead of change, modifying from the original array, it duplicates it and puts it in the array of itself, like it puts it in the new basket 
instead of taking from the original array and putting it here. So now I'm going to talk about splice. So splice is mostly like slice, but it is more confusing and hard to understand. So the first parameter are, as always is the starting, so I'm going to give dates. The setup parameter you think is the end, you might think it's the end, but it actually is not. It's how much it should delete from now on. For example, I'm just going to give so here oh. I'm just going to put this and put it over here. So this is the original array. Clear this and refresh it. So this is the original array where all of them are. So you can see here it deleted everything. Dates. You can see here dates till L beta plum is deleted. So if we give the first parameter B, it deletes all of them, which is next. So you can see dates and all of them till the I beta plum deleted. So the second parameter is not the end parameter, it's where it should delete all of this. So if we give one here and we just If I give one only, you can see here date which was in 3 was deleted, and you can see here it is A, B, C, E, and D is over here. So, on splice, it takes from the original array and puts it in the it puts it in its array. So now, I want to delete three of them. So you can see here, take to the original. So if you give console dot table before the, the variable declared, like I've given here console dot table fruit basket, it didn't take. So if I put this here again, it still will take from that. So I'm just going to clear this. And you can see here it has come 5 instead of 8 and all of them are here so that's why I gave it that instead of giving it after declaring the splice so on splice there is one more thing which is really fun but so you can add items for example I want over the jack so I'm going to give jack to have to give it in cycles. So you can see here it has added jack root in 3. And like, like push, it will add in push, it will actually add in the end if I give like push. Fruit basket dot push. But while using splice operation, it doesn't do actually add where the point it should be. So if I give one here, so you can see all those are deleted. A, B, C, D, E is deleted. And now over here, jack root is over here. So you can add how much ever I want. For example, I want to add orange. So you can see your orange is added right over here. So now as I said, I'm going to add over here. Now I'm going to add it. So here the code is a bit different. It's document. Document is like this page. Document dot get elements. Let get element by ID. 
will give basket which is from the old basket it's going to print over here so we're going to give two so the basket dot inner html which is going to be the two basket I have given splice and to move them, it's showing this. So I'm just gonna give over here. So you can see here, it comes like this apple, jackfruit, orange, banana, cherry, dates, elderberry, grapes, plums, and apples. And now I'm gonna print it for the new basket. So I'm just going to copy this. get element by id it's going to be new basket so i've given it over here the id over here is basket and here over here is new basket i'm going to give new basket or oh, then i'll give start of new basket it's new basket given the official black Over here, I given zero. So if I give one, you can see banana is printed. So I'm gonna show with splice operation. I'm gonna give if I give twelve, it comes all of them. So I'm just going to clear this and give slice. So I'm gonna give. Two to five. No, two to six. So it will be off. Mm, this is one. So one. I'm gonna go one to six. So one, two, three, four, five, six. But as I said, it'll exclude the last. So I want to fake. Two to six. You can see here. Cherry dates. Oh wait, not two. Banana cherry dates. Elderberry fig. So you can see here, it didn't take from the original array. So, so. so thanks for watching. If you like my video, like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.